comfortable. <laughs> oh, sweet Jesus. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. I'm really excited today just to sit down. There's a cat at the door. Who is it? It's me. Do a bit Yep. Do you want to say hello? Yeah. Yeah. Meow. Anything else? Okay. As I was saying, today we're going to just test out some skincare. There's a second cat at the door. Is that Penny? Do you want to say hi? Okay, apparently I cannot get through a sentence. So I'm gonna be trying some K-Beauty today and it is all snail mucin products. So this video is not sponsored, but I did get sent these things from YesStyle. If you don't know about YesStyle, you are missing out because they've got all the K-Beauty, J-Beauty. And not only that, like you can find skincare, makeup, hair care, accessories, clothing, decor. And not only that, but Korean skincare is just top notch in my opinion. There's just something about K-Beauty. It just works for me. And I do have a code for YesStyle. It's AmyErica10 right here, spelled just like my name here, but no underscore. I'll also link down below YesStyle and the products that we're gonna be talking about. So let's go ahead and get started. We got the Black Snail Bubble Mask. This is from The Skin House. It's a bubble deep clean mask, refining, pore minimizing. All right, here's the mask. I'm kind of liking the packaging. It's just like black and simple. So it's apply an adequate amount on the face and when bubbles come up, massage through the face in a circular motion and wash off with clean water. Basically, you let it bubble up and then massage and rinse off. It's coming. Oh! Oh, it's actually like a black gel. Okay. Oh, it's already starting to try to bubble up. Okay, let me hurry. Oh, I'm just hot right now, but the gel feels like nice and cooling. Come on. My little baby hairs. Little baby hairs are always getting in product. I always have makeup and skincare on my baby hairs. This smells nice. It smells like fresh. Very clean scent. If you guys have never tried any snail products, which I think they're fairly well known now, it's been a Korean ingredient for a long time. But my first time around, I was like, oh, I don't know if I can use this. Like I was expecting the worst. I have had one or two products that were kind of like a slimier consistency, but I've never had any of them really feel like gross. Nothing like I expected. I just had like this idea in my head that it was going to be gross and it really wasn't at all. Ooh. This is starting to tickle. It's not bubbled up on my nose yet, but I can tell it's it's gonna be ticklish. So far so good though. Like my skin feels comfortable. <laughs> it's just tickling. Any bubble mask always tickles my face. Okay, my nose is getting bubbly now. I'm gonna start massaging over here. Oh, it's such relief when it's all tickly and you just wanna scratch it and then you can rub it in. It's such a relief. Wow. And now it's just turning to like this kind of creamy consistency. It doesn't feel as much of a gel anymore. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, look, it's getting foamy again. Okay. I think it's time to rinse off. I think it's done what it's supposed to. So, <laughs> this is really tickling. So I'm gonna go rinse it off. I can't quite put my finger on it, but this mask made my skin feel so refreshed and it feels clean but very comfortable and you know that's my thing too like the only cleansers that i love leave my skin feeling clean but also feeling comfortable not tight like my skin feels like really refreshed and clean i don't know what's up with that but i love it big thumbs up to that the only downside is the tickling <laughs> Which, uh, I mean, it's it's momentarily and I feel like it's totally worth this like refreshed feeling of my skin. My pores look so good. I messed with my nose a little bit so it turned red. I was just like, like this and my nose is getting red. But my pores look really great. I'm going to move on to the essence. So the brand is CosRx or C-O-S-R-X. I'm not sure. But this is the Advanced Snail 96 Mucin Power Essence. Now, I have not tried a snail essence before. I'm definitely intrigued. Essences are, I feel like the thing that now that I've added them to my routine, even though like my, my products cycle out and I try different things because I love to, I find that adding an essence just does something good for my skin. I love to put my essence on before hyaluronic acid. That way, the hyaluronic acid is gonna use the water or ingredients in there to really plump up the cells of your skin. So instead of just having damp skin before putting hyaluronic acid on, I prefer an essence. That way you get more treatment, more benefits, all that good stuff. Oh, it says it's 96% snail secretion filtrate 
mucin. This essence helps the skin to lose less moisture while keeping the skin smooth and healthy. It's a little bit thicker than some of the essences that I use that are kind of like watery. It feels good. I mean, considering that it's 96% of that, it doesn't feel like it's got this little slip to it. Um, but it doesn't feel slimy or anything like that. I hate to even use that word, but that may be what's popping into your head because that was certainly my first thought before using products. And I was checking too, just out of my own curiosity to make sure that what I remembered was accurate. So I was looking at the snail extraction process because I know there will be some questions about this. So Kosar X, which is the brand of this serum specifically is cruelty free, meaning that the snails are not harmed in this process. The only downside is if you're looking for a vegan products, these will not be it because they are an animal based product. Even though they're not harmed or tested on animals, it still is an animal byproduct. So obviously it cannot be a vegan product. So let's look at this. This is from, I don't even know how this is pronounced, but it's like Ionic Black Snail Edition Skincare Set. So this is a little set that you can get on Yes Style. And this has a serum and a cream. So this is the Black Snail Restore Serum. It looks like about the thickness of the essence. So I'm going to drop it on my skin. You can see I'm not, I wasn't touching the dropper to my skin, just dropping it on, which I like doing. All right, I used a pretty generous amount, but if you're curious what snail is supposed to do for you, um, it's supposed to give you soft, hydrated, supple skin. So that serum feels really good. The essence also feels great. It really sank into the skin. So even though it's not as thin as a lot of essences, like SK2 is, is basically the consistency of water. This was a little bit thicker, but it still sank in really, really well. Okay, let's use the Black Snail Restore Cream. So that has the snail secretion filtrate, 50 percent and then it has centella asiatica 9.8 percent so you got 68 percent of it from just two ingredients that's really cool so this is what it looks like it's just a little cream so that's what it looks like this reminds me of like a cream gel consistency that feels really nice i feel like this is a really nice little kit if you wanted to try some snail products but you didn't want to get like a bunch of full sizes now one of my favorite brands secret key i've really enjoyed everything that i've tried from them this is the snail repairing eye cream and for me the eye area anything hydrating i want it give it to me i'm going to use a pretty generous amount that's honestly too much you only need about the size of a cooked grain of rice when it comes to eye cream i always go overboard a little bit i am definitely the person who tells you what to do and then does the opposite it feels really really good okay i'm excited for that one especially i have one more product now this is a sleeping mask but i still want to try it out this is snail and azaline sleeping mask I will let you guys just look at the brand <laughs> because I'm not gonna try to butcher that. So it's T-I-A-M, which if you're not dumb like me, you may be able to have seen that. It says to apply evenly to the face, the last step in your nighttime routine. So I'm actually gonna do makeup after this, but YOLO, it's fine. All right, so here's the jar. It's really pretty. Now, Azaline gives a tint like this, so you'll see it naturally, but it's supposed to be good for antimicrobial benefits and also anti-inflammatory, which I need because my skin gets inflamed at times and I don't have like the typical reaction. Some people just break out from products. Some people will have itching, redness, irritation. I just typically get like flushed and hot in my skin. So things like this are helpful for me when I'm using stronger products because I'm not going to completely stop using certain products just because I get flushed. Um, I just use something either calming or soothing to kind of help me deal with that. Unless it's extreme, obviously. That feels so good. I'll definitely try this again tonight after removing my makeup and all of that, but it feels super, super nice on my skin. Like this is one of my favorite products from this little try on, but I'm actually thoroughly impressed. I don't really know how to pick a favorite. I love all of these. The little set was nice. I feel like that's just one of those things that I'd have to use for longer to really see the results. The bubble mask made my skin feel super clean, super fresh. The essence really sank in. I like that because I wanna know that it's going deep into my skin and working at a deeper level than other products can. The eye cream feels incredibly hydrating. And then this, I didn't know what to expect. I don't think I've ever tried this brand, but my skin feels amazing. Just give you guys a look at my skin. I mean, trying new products, you 
never know. Like every once in a while you can have a problem. So yeah, that's my skin. I feel like my skin feels amazing. I'm really impressed. So yeah, that's all of the snail products I got from Yes Style. So if you want to check any of them out, just go ahead and click the down bar and it will show you a link. Uh, I'll also put my discount code. Of course, if you want to just go and use that, you can. And then I will have the products listed as well so that you can check them out. And that is it. I don't know what else to say because that is it. I loved everything. I don't really have any negatives to say other than that mask was tickly AF. <laughs> But if that's the worst of it, then we're doing just fine. So thank you guys so much for hanging with me and just trying out some products. Let me know what other type of videos you want to see. I keep basically doing like vlogs, declutters, things like that. Um, and of course my subscription unboxings. But if something outside that realm that you would like to see that I have not done or haven't done in some time, please let me know. I am open to suggestions. And thank you guys again. I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.